Hey everybody, Frank and Carrie. Hey, welcome back. You already know us. <laughs> We've introduced ourselves many, many times. Yeah. We know there are lots of people here that that uh, tour video keeps growing and growing. And, wow, and thank you for that. Um, and somebody actually made a great comment on that tour video. Since we call it, what, do we, what did I say, uh, a whirlwind tour is what I call it. And somebody goes, oh, you mean it was a tornado? <laughs> <laughs> we got the funniest viewers. We really do. Yeah, we do. Uh, especially if they get my humor. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh -huh. <laughs> but uh, we didn't have very much fun today. I mean, fun is relative, right? Right, right. So we decided to, we're getting towards spring. Yes. Pulled out Jeannie. We did. To find out how much work we had to do on the tower to see if, uh, and man, oh man. It's a we're gonna have uh, it's a total redo. <laughs> we're gonna have a lot of fun because we do this for fun. So we're gonna have a lot, a lot of, of fun. fun. You 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 rebuilding the tower and me with the the mixer. Oh, you'll be up there too. I'll I'll need help. But yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Luckily, Jeannie in that range can do a thousand pounds because we're gonna have her straight up. Yeah, yeah. She because we got some. Major Probably yeah. 650, 700 pound stones. Mm -hmm. They're not as big as the ones on this front facade, but they're way up there. Yeah, they are. Yeah, yeah they are. I was a little unnerved just being up there that far, but I'll get used to it. It's, you know, you have to get your air legs again. <laughs> you get it, sea legs yeah, and I air legs. It. Yeah, and, I got it. I got it. <laughs> but we'll be safe. We will. Always am. And, and are. So, See you next week. We appreciate well, you. This is just an intro. Yeah, so we appreciate you stopping by and thanks for watching. Hey Frank, what you doing with Jeannie? Uh, this is the boom lift that we have to use to get up to the top. What oh. do you mean? Well, where are we going on the top? Oh, we're going to inspect some stuff because it's getting warmer. Yay. And we might actually get to use Jeannie again. Hey, sounds like a plan. To do some stuff. All right, very good. All right, let's go. There he goes. I'm not exactly sure where on this beauty we are actually going to inspect. But it's, oh, there went a bunny. Run, bunny, run. Poor little thing, we scared it. Maybe we're gonna go up and inspect that chimney. So, the nice thing about Jeannie is I get to go too, and that's, Looks like that's what we're gonna go take a look at. Alrighty, we're gonna go up and see how much we gotta do on this side chimney. I figure we stop here on our way to the tower. That's where our ultimate destination ah, is. Ah, okay. All right. So, we're gonna go up here. And it's gonna get loud because I'm gonna put it in rabbit mode. Oh, were we not in rabbit mode? No, that was turtle mode. Oh, turtle mode. But I don't know exactly what rabbit mode does, but I hope it doesn't give us more genies. <laughs> because we don't need any more genies. No. All right. Frank working the controls. gander at the wall while the we're at it. needs more mortar. Yeah. Yeah. That vine you see is poison ivy. It's been repointed at some point up here. <gasps> Whoa. Hello. Is that cement mortar? This is the 
fancy mortar that they bought that is it's not as bad as cement mortar but it's bad enough now okay let's give you an idea up close but it's I mean I'm not that this is the original lime mortar and yeah. it's really good shape yeah yeah there you go so, it just needs to be repointed yeah cornice molding. Okay, while well, I'm here. Yeah, we might as well grab a couple of slates out of the pocket so yeah. they don't fall on somebody. Yeah, really. <sighs> well, where'd it come from? I have no idea where it came from. So, if anybody's wondering, this is what box gutters look like. This is the gutter part, and then it's incorporated into the cornice molding here. And this is all the way around the Moreland house. Right. And you and can- that's what the problem is. Right. Or you, a problem. You can see right there in the corner how, what shape, that's the shape they're in. If they're even there, I think this is the one that's in the I mean you've got rips in it the squirrels love it all right let's keep going up. Yeah, let's keep going all right oh we're missing a stone uh, it's broken anyway yeah So this is original. This is goes into the wood framing in the attic. Okay. So this doesn't surprise me that this big thing's here. They have repointed with cement. So I don't know what it looks like behind there. Do you think that cement mortar is what caused that stone over there to break? Uh I, I don't think it you don't think so helped but you can tell that it's brick here and it's this stone facade I mean we call it a facade but it's really a stone wall because these stones are a minimum of six inches across I mean that would make any stone wall but it looks like it's still in decent shape because all the stones below it are solid still. So, so far I haven't seen anything scary. This stone is broken, but that's not a bad thing. But we had somebody look at it yesterday and they were trying to figure out why the top is gray and this part is not. Well, now that we're up here, we can tell all this is cement mortar. So it's holding the, it's holding the water in the stones. So we'll continue up. that the moisture is being trapped behind some of these and they're starting to break the face off the stone. Yeah. But can you see the, 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 sun. the pattern? Yeah. Wow, beautiful. There's a nice pattern on the stones that you can't really see anymore because it's all dark and cloudy. I mean, gray, whatever. But yeah, so. This is definitely 
gonna have to be repointed. Yeah. It'll be fun trying to find out if any of this is bad. But all the stones look like they're in decent shape. Yeah. Well, I wonder if things like this, if when they repointed it, if they just stuck rocks in there. So we don't know if these are original rocks or not. It's always something. But the reason why we got out Genie is we're gonna go look at that. Uh. So now we gotta drive around and uh, see how that's going. But it doesn't look like we'll have to take this chimney down. It just means repointing. Of course, see, like there, that's just empty. And that's what it looks like behind the cement mortar, I'm sure, in most of the places. There's just uh, nothing there. That chimney needs redone as well. Ah, well, they all need redone. I mean, repointed. I don't know how they just got up and did cement mortar on the tops of some of these. Maybe it was, uh, I don't know, that's, that looks dangerous without a boom lift. Because we're up a little ways. Ways, here's a look around. You can kind of see how far we're up. Kind of a little look at Harrodsburg here downtown's that way. We're not as tall as the roof yet though. No, nope, we're not. Anything no. else you need up here? Will no. I go up the rest or down? No, I don't think so. I never did find where that slate came off at. Oh, who knows? Yeah. It, it probably came from that roof. Probably. And slid down and slid down. Probably. But there's another shot of a box gutter that isn't there. Yeah. I'll zoom in a little bit. frozen so she's not leaving huge prints in the yard and we're headed that way we are in rabbit mode look at us go totally missing. You can see the remnants of that one over there. Alrighty, the reason for this is we think that this is our next project. In fact, we know it is. Because if you can see these bricks used to come around here and they're starting to lean out because there's nothing holding them but gravity. So all this is resting on those. And as soon as they go, they go. You can see this stone right there. We certainly are not touching that because there's bricks under there 
that are as bad as these. Same with that one. So you can see there's no mortar in between. There's, so, uh, there's a lot of pressure on the cornice molding right there. So, we know what our next project is. We're gonna have to take those stones down. Shouldn't be that hard since... Uh, since most of them don't have any mortar in them? Yeah. Yeah. But we'll, we'll be able to give the neighborhood a show. Yeah. They like that. Bertha got us up this far, but she was lacking maybe four to five feet from the top. And Frank redid all the slate on this side right over here. We've already done that. We put a new valley in. And we have temporary roofing there. All right. Oh yeah. Lots of cement mortar in there, or no mortar. Okay. Yeah. This is the first time we've inspected this part and uh, wow. Yeah. See the, uh, we're gonna have to take down most of the tower. Yeah. I don't, I don't think Bertha's gonna be able to reach this stone though. So we'll have to figure something else out, no, but Bertha it's it's at least an inch out, and that's a 750 pound stone right there. Yeah, well, ain't that a fine how you do? But you know what? We do it because we love it, and we're really gonna get to love this, <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah, that's for sure. It does give you a sense of height, though, when you're up here. Oh, and more box gutters. Yeah. More box gutters. They're all the way around the house. Well, yeah. that's that. Now we know. This is, we gotta do this before we do the dormer. Yeah, believe it or not, that dormer is stable. Because there. That's that dormer. It can't fall anymore. No. And those 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 stones that you see kind of in stacks a little bit, that's what came fell from here. So we we recovered most of the stones. Um I can't really point to it, but this one's right here and they're kind of in a in, in We have them kind of kind of where they need to go. Right. But okay. we got some masonry work to do. A little bit. And I don't know where that rock came from, but uh, I don't it wasn't there before. It was there the other day, but it, I'm But sure it's it, recent. I think it came from the backside. We haven't ever really inspected the backside. Ay, ay, ay. So, oh, yeah, see, I didn't realize how far that was far. That had fallen. Or, for, for those who are curious, it's right here is where I'm talking about. Just right there it's amazing to zoom in a little bit it's we're in a bad position actually for filming that but there you go that's what I'm talking about right there okay never put cement mortar over lime mortar this is why because that more than likely had cement mortar in it until it dissolved the lime mortar and then yeah yeah I mean, you can you can see like right here, you can see where they put the. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's a good example right there, and the the lime mortar is gone behind it. Because it dissolved. Yeah. But if they hadn't, if they'd have patched it with just lime mortar, that's what it. I mean, that's original. Yeah. It would have done just fine. Ay ay ay. This is gonna be fun way up here. Yeah. 
Yeah, it is. And when I say fun, we're going to love it like crazy because we love doing this kind of work. Cause... <laughs> uh. Yeah. Anything else you want to see up here? Um, no. I'm high enough right now. Yeah. Oh, well, do you want to go all the way up and see the top, the tippy top? Since we're this close? Spooky? No. Good for me. How in the world are we going to get these big stones? I don't know. I don't know because Bertha doesn't get that this oh, high. I know. Okay, another gutter. Here's the top for those who actually want to see what the top looks like. It's we put some patches on there, but hey, so I'm surprised some of them are still on there. Yeah, I am too. I mean, we know that we've got holes everywhere. We know that it's not waterproof, but we're just, she'll get a new roof post haste once we get the, the masonry work done. Yay. Yeah, but that's what the top looks like from the outside. From the outside, and there's the back side of that chimney we were inspecting. There's, there's our real pretty rolled roof that, torch down that we did. Looks like it's doing really nice. There's all our chimneys. All those chimneys need repointing. Yeah, we know. But. And coming down. Here's a nice look at the trench. Uh-huh. <laughs> no need to ask. He's a smooth operator. He's a smooth operator. Here's another look at the damage to the tower. What are you doing, Mia? What are you doing? Are you sleeping in the parlor? Are you sleeping in the parlor? This is one of your favorite spots. Yeah, it's my sweet girl. Mm -hmm. You're sleepy on the sunny day. Mm -hmm. My good girl. Yes. Oh, that feel good. My sweet girl. <laughs> 